we might as well have a little dive in to see what we've had. I am good, thank you. How are you doing? I've changed the formula a little bit where the target is just to do about 30 a day. Unless it feels like it's going really well. That's good. Um, hopefully we can see some more of these random ones. So we'll just go box to box. Um, these are more for if I want to use them as tokens, your spares. Nothing fancy in that one. And the Gengar was actually a Haunter that evolved. And then the next day I got a Gengar again. Which wasn't much help. Um, elsewhere... Uh, let's see... We finally got both Magikarp and Gyarados. Um, there was some funky ones later. we got the Jolteon, so that's two of the evolutions done. Uh, let's see, I know there's some... We did get about three Charizards that were shiny in two days. <laughs> this looks all normal, that's all normal. I think the evolutions, if they quite often appear in like raids and people try and catch them for like the the terror stuff, so I feel like I might get a few traded over. So this is the weirdest Charizard I got, because according to all the information about it, it actually came from a Game Boy. So it's come all the way from Johto. So I don't really know how old or what for this one. That's why I kept this one. Um, yesterday we actually got both the two Volpixes, which I liked. Um, I don't think that's a shiny, is it? Oh, that is shiny. It's an interesting one, but... Does it, have an item? it doesn't even have an item, so it's a strange one, that one. Uh, anything else fancy? Obviously we've still got the Infernape. The Munchlatch was actually shiny too. Yeah, I haven't actually kept it, but I did have uh, a shiny Ossawot come through. But we got rid of that one yesterday straight away. Yeah, that's a good point about the GPC, but unless there could be a potential way of going through other systems. So maybe like through the GameCube or Wii or something, and then into Ruby. I, I don't know, it's probably a hacked one, let's be honest. I got rid of the shiny Trevenant that I got, which evolved as well. We did get a shiny Rillaboom. But otherwise, that's it. So, well, that's the Trevenant. We still have it, but it's going today. This lot's all going. They're ones I just kept because I didn't want to keep doing too many trades. Trefferton is one of the better few uh, shinies. It's one that it's probably actually huntable because it's so different for once. Uh, so let's go and collect my Lechonks for the day. I still have my six tokens. I did manage to just about get another one yesterday because I did a few more.
Um, but I still haven't decided what I'm doing with them. Like, I have um, a Charmander that's close to evolving, so I could use one for the Charmeleon, but it's just as easy to save it till uh, later. I can catch the Fletching to now. Um, I have a lot more of the starters. Um, there's still a few missing. Um, I think I still need the X and Y couple. The Fennekin and the Chespin lines. But I did end up getting all the Galar ones yesterday. Uh, I've, I've got two of each of the Paldeas. Again, I'm trying not to evolve unless I have to. And this is thinking more when we get to like the three or four hundred. When the trades are going to be literally all repeats and stuff like that. That's when I want to start utilising the potential of evolving anything. We know some are a lot easier, like... For, for some random reason I got the Fletchinder before I got the Fletching. And obviously I got the Vigor off and the Slacking, but not the Slack off. I expect the legendaries will only come through as the shiny hacked ones. Um, I know from just playing around when I was doing Sword and Shield, I got a few. I and I've mentioned before, I have had one of the four corner ones in this one. I want to say it was Wu Chin, but I can't remember what the names are. I forget between the the moose and the snails names. I know um the tiger. I haven't had I probably have seen the shiny ones of the legendaries. I, because I can't do too much shiny hunting, I don't study all of the shinies as much as I probably should. At the amount of shinies I've probably walked past in this or my proper game. I think I just can't tell them apart, so if I miss them, I miss them. <laughs> can't help that. So, if at least with um, legends, you got the sparkles. That was the key thing. We needed the sparkles. I haven't really done any more exploring of the map because I don't need. To do too much in the map yet. But it would be interesting to know if you can try the gym challenges before going through Mesagoza. They probably just don't show up, like none of the terror raids show up for me. Yeah, I would never do a proper 
legendary shiny hunt. I, I just could have put myself through that. I hate even just doing the sandwich hunt in this game. I know the reward would be good and the only legitimate shiny legendary I have is a Moltres. Which I did get in Pokemon Go back in the day. In these games, um, the last one I got in a Scarlet or Violet was I got a Graveler. So that's not, not very exciting. It's the only thing I've got on the DLC side of things. I wanted to try and get the Puccina, but didn't happen. I didn't even try sandwiches for that, but no, nothing really came from that. So I just gave up on that one. Um, I know there's like a really good place for Hoot Hoot, which I also had a look at, but... I'm just a bit too lazy to go and check all the raids, or not the mass outbreaks each day. Because I'm doing like this part of the surprise trade, and I'm also doing my Nuzlocke on Shining Pearl. That better gross must be a great shiny to have. I have actually seen that one. Hopefully, it'll become a bit easier to hunt for in the future. See, I feel I should have seen a shiny in here by now, with the amount of just random encounters I've sort of had. But it's one of those you can go like one minute you can find like five or six, and then the next you you can go days without. Why do they have to be awkward, some of these? Like, just go in the ball. You're not going to beat my team. Yes, that little Marrow thing's coming with me because I felt like it was haunting me last episode. There's one following me the whole way around the game. And those hoppips that invaded my house. I did all my trades round the house yesterday just because I didn't have too many to catch because I had um, 12 carryovers last time. Let's see what was that up to? Not too many, only nine more. I seem to have got the catching thing down a bit better now, just flying through that side of things. Yeah, it's just hoping we get to see what else is. I'm only going to do one box at a time. I. I had an episode a couple of days ago where um, nobody was here. <laughs> so I was literally just doing this for an hour talking to myself, which was a bit odd. Well, 
I feel like if I just cut it to 30ish and then if it's chatty chatty and we're getting some really good new mons. We keep going. If I'm having a day where I'm getting 30 trades and 30 re duplicates, I don't want to... It just feels like it's going to be a bad day, just take the break. Come back tomorrow. It also helps depending on if I want to clear the duplicates or not. I'm interested to see which uh, free stage evolution I will complete first. There's quite a few, we're at two, we've got Nackley slacking, Charmander fletching. Um, if we can actually let have evolve, we've got two of the Merry Blind as well. Not ones that um, I can evolve myself. Oh, we've got two of the Marrow Line too. It's no worries, you don't have to stay the whole time. I know that everybody has stuff to do. Uh, I'll watch people where I could only be around for a half hour. Lots and lots of baby puffs. Okay, so I might see you a bit later. I'm sure... If it's going smoothly, and there's some good ones. Enjoy the rest of the day. one we've got to catch today. Uh, let's double check. We oh, no one more, we have one more to catch. That one wants to come with me so it's coming to say hello. Court. We're fairly in the box, ready to go. So, like yesterday, we're going to start by just doing one at a time and hopefully go through the 30. And just stick with just the 30 not do too many 
more duplicates. I really do wish they would make these games with the same controls instead of changing the buttons on each game. The amount of times I want to press a button that does something normally. So off we go with the running around the Pokestop. The first trade is with our friend and good friend I would like to think. First, ironically is called First. It's just strange how this all worked out. And they give us a slacking. So that's a very interesting first one to get. Um, so off to Fletchin. Off you go, little birdie. And next on the block is our friend UTA who wants to give us a bishop which is another repeat not a good start but we've had this before where the top row was all dupes and then suddenly we hit As we did before, we're going to stumble on home. And see what pops up along the way. So third on the block is Raoul. Come on Raoul, treat me well. Raoul, a Rolks. I think I need Rolks. Might not do, no. Yes, I do, right? That's good. That's the uh, first new one of the day. And off goes Le Chonk into the world. To see our fourth friend. Who's hopefully going to continue our new streak of one? And this friend is Ian. So, Ian, I'm expecting something extremely good from you. That's not ideal because I've got too many Sprickatitos now. But I appreciate that you're giving out um, starters and people around the world will be lucky to get them. So, good work Ian. It's no help for me. Who this was going to? Uh, oh, come on, I, I need the first Evo. James, you let me down. So that's not okay. We've got one more to see whether this is a disaster start. But we are running extremely low on options to get a new token today. So who is our friend this time? I can't pronounce, but I'm hoping that means they're going to give me something extra special. Because that's... 
a Feebas. I've got a Feebas. Does this evolve? If it evolves, then it's good. It's not good. That says that's one in six, which is. I now need to have a complete run of no repeats. To have a, a good session now. So Scatterbug is going to someone else. Let's just say our prayers and hope for something good. The shelter might be new shelter. See, this is why I want to just do the 30s because I can't quite remember what's new and what's not. Shelter is new. So that's nice. That's two. So this row is going to be currently at 100%. Which is good to see. And this trade's going a long way, so. And we have another person I can't pronounce. And the Stone Journal, that's new. That's definitely new. Happy with that one. Still at 100% on this row. Now, oh, Scatterbug, release to the world your delight. Maybe you'll be one of the Vivions that everyone's trying to catch. So this friend is Ray. That this is going to be a hack shiny. But it's going to stay as a haunter, even if it does try to. Well, I don't care. Or will? No, you're not evolving haunter. You're going to stay like that for the rest of your life. Okay, you can't stop the trade evos. Learn that today. Oh, I'm so annoyed with that one, I'm just going to send it straight back out there. I don't want it. Don't need it. Gone. That's what we're doing. If any hacked and shinies, if they're not additions, they're going straight away. I missed who's getting this one. <laughs> Nackley! Yes! We finished the Nackley line. That's my reward for not deciding to keep her hacked shiny. First free stage Evo complete. And it's one that's only in this game. So oh, I am actually happy with that. That's what we needed. Um, this one's taking a little bit longer, but this friend is going to be nice enough to give us. Is Eric? Come on, Eric! I feel that like you've got something good coming this way. Something new. Bonsla, not so good, Eric. I'm just pointed in you. Uh, where are we here? Lechonk time. 
the chunks bring me luck, right? Da -da -da -da. So, the chunk is going to my new friend that I can't pronounce. And that looks like it's something shiny. Oh, it actually looks normal on that one, actually. Looks shiny in the trading screen. It could be shiny, I'll be honest. I can't really tell to it. It's one that doesn't have too much of a difference. go up here, get home quicker. We have the trade coming through. Oh, it's another hack shiny. If this is another haunter, then we know what they're doing today. Riolo. We'll hold on to it for now. one I feel will get traded a lot so not going to complain as much but we've done 12 so or 13 technically so number 14 I seem to have found when that person's doing all their trading. So, Gail, I'm expecting something lovely from you. Maybe a Rilo Riolu. Syrian Zora. Can't complain. They're nice Pokemon to get. It would be funny if I ended up trading that Trevenant back to the, the people sending all the... the hacked ones in. So this friend is... That was a, a long name to read. <laughs> Not going to try and pronounce that one either. Another Ropes, so we call from the Ropes, the two Ropes. We can't complain with this, shall we say. So I'm getting surrounded by hoppips again. These evil little white clouds. Yeah, I'm going to run away from you. See if you follow me here. Uh, peachy, hey? Is so it peachy? Feeling something good coming from you. Yeah, that's uh, another scope it. Um, so not not great. Go for a real drive hatch now. These hoppets are everywhere. Rough. Yes, that's actually new. Pretty sure I've only had the evil with that. Ravavoom. Varoom. Room. Yes, so that's good. 
That is new. Thank you, Ref. And we got the next Pokedex reward. We'll save that for a bit later. See how many evil hoppips follow me round my house today. Um, Stalvos. Hey, shiny Charizard. I haven't had too many of them recently. That's going back. Bye bye, shiny Charizard. We don't need you. So, who's the lucky one that's getting a shiny Charizard off me? I get a side up. At least it's a real side up. That's all that matters, it's real. Um, yeah. Not ideal, but it's real, right? No more of these hacked in nonsense ones. Um, Nano! What's that? A tiny mouth. Tiny. I forgot what the thing's called. It's the thing that's just really annoying and so forgettable. Tynamo. Tynamo. Okay, so... Hello, NYC. Welcome to the surprise trade. Only living ducks. Sorry. Hello, Sky. Uh, Megan is getting my Fido. So hopefully I get something good from Megan. Yes, that's actually something we did need. Tarantula. Uh, the ones we've collected so far, we can go through that quickly. Um, yeah, there's no rush. So the ones we've actually got for this, it's not too many, we've only got 157. Uh, this one's probably our best box. Uh, there's nothing overly fancy yet. We did manage to finish the Knackley line in a minute ago. I usually put them all into the right spot at the end or more or less between streams. Um, what is it that you were really after because I've not sort of set up and I've got like everything to be traded as such a lot of a lot of my challenge is to see what I can get out of the surprise trade
So I don't want to take anything off anyone who isn't just getting rid of stuff almost. And I don't really have anything overly special to trade at the moment. <laughs> The only one that's being lined up that will be getting traded is somebody had sent me a hacked in um, Trevenant Shiny. Uh, that's going. If you did want that, I can send it to you, but it is a hacked in one. So it might not be safe for like home or anything. But it is a nice shiny, I'm not going to lie. This account is planning to never touch home. I don't have a shiny dig. I... As I say, I haven't got things that are like shiny to be sent planned. I'm not going to ask anyone to get rid of any shinies that they have um, unless they just don't want them. It's not fair on people that. If you did want to send one thing over, I'd say do something that's not shiny. Uh, you can pick anything you want and we'll do it as like, the last little trade. Is there any... Is there any in this box you would like? So some I've got to keep, but some I've got to... Or any of the starters or anything. Now I do just one, and that could be the surprise because it was a surprise to find someone in chat who wanted to trade. I don't currently have a Vaporeon, no. I've only got. Jolteon and Glaceon so far. We we can do that one if you want. As I said, is there anything you would like out of this box? I need to keep a Rolt, Shelder, Stone Journey, Knackley, Verum, Tynamo and Dusclops. The rest are all free to go again. Oh, and the Tarantula I need to keep. shiny here. Oh, another shiny Rayolu. I've had two of them today. Yeah. 
that one. Hello, Oak. I know how you mentioned about the hack shinies. We have two Riolos in about 12 trades. Yep, Trevenant will be going to stay, definitely. I obviously had a Haunter which did evolve into a Gengar that came through, but I've got a Gengar, so I sent that one straight back out the door. Uh, ghastly, well, I decided I'm just going to cut it down to just doing 30, and if I have carryovers now for the next stream. So many Gengars, just so many. Why is there so many Gengars? And it's a legitimate Gengar too, which probably got caught somewhere else. I know you have mentioned that you didn't want to know too much about the DLC, so you might see some other Pokemon in the DLC in this. Now some of them have been in like the raid, some of them are legitimately only in there but they're like what you call first root mons you shouldn't see any of the biggest reveals shall we say I've actually got some of them already put away so we won't even need to go to that page I literally just don't know what I'm going to get, so if I get them, <laughs> there's your warning. But I am happy that the Hoppips haven't decided to attack my house today, like they were doing yesterday. I was playing on ra running around my house in this, and there was about five in my yard, and it, they just kept chasing me. I love the trades for trades. I always get one a stream, don't I? Go <laughs> uh, to actually just run back and get rid of the second Riolu. Because I'll keep one for now until we get the right one. We are nearing the end of our selection to trade. I feel like if people want to keep them, they're welcome to. A snow! That's definitely new. actually completed another evolution line so I like that. We've completed a couple of Evo lines today. I think I might be around 170 because it's been a slower day today if I've been honest. Oh 
no, here comes another Riolu, isn't it? Bound to be another one. Oh no, it's a Pichu, and I have Pichu. Don't need that. 100% don't need that. And because it's a one of those, it's going straight away. I think this is the only person out there trading con as much as I am. So, well, enjoy your shiny Pichu. At least they're nice enough to use the luxury balls. And a Spaffra, another dupe. So we currently have two left. We have this Eevee. And we'll have that Trevenant unless we get another annoying shiny we're just going to see what the numbers look like before we decide to call it quits a phalanx pretty confident that's new There's that evil hoppet come back again. What is with these hoppets sneaking into my yard? No wonder we needed to get a meowth. Well, somebody's getting a nice, beautiful, shiny Trevenant. One so far for Kapu is drum roll, please. Da -da. A Copperaja, which is new to so let's just have a quick count of what's new. We'll try and put them together. Nimble is new, which is nice. Shelter was new, and the Rolch was new. So we've actually only had 13 new ones today, it's a little bit disappointing. Really. But never mind. That's going to be what's going to happen during this. It's going to get a bit more bogged down. I don't know if Sky is still there. If they want to send um, the Vaporeon through, they're more than welcome. To add to the collection. But at the moment there is no new token today, which is a bit disappointing. But I guess that's going to be the end of this episode. Um, Thank you for watching along and cheering along the trades. Until next time, I guess 
will welcome the surprises. Goodbye.